I don't know about you, I feel like it might be time to bring another guest out. Don't we think, guys? Should we bring another guest out onto the show? Should we bring in another guest? Ladies and gentlemen, here uh, on television for the first time since he won three Grammys earlier in the year for his album Morning Phase, please welcome the incredible Beck! <laughs> Look at Tommy's face! <laughs> <laughs> Just as Beck shook Tommy's hand, Tommy went, Will you sign an album for me? <laughs> I have five of your albums on vinyl. Really? <laughs> yeah. There's, well, there's oh, one right there. here. There's one oh, right here. Yeah. Here we go. Bring it in, bring it in. Uh, this, is, this is Morning Face, Beck's three Grammy award-winning <laughs> album. <laughs> You'll sign this for Tommy uh, later. Thank okay. you. Thank you yeah. so much for being here. Thanks for, for uh, your... Thank you so much. It's, it's just... <laughs> I mean, you guys, like, you've lived here for 12 years, Tommy. You never thought, hmm, air conditioning, maybe that's an idea. <laughs> <laughs> Chosen to live I... in California. <laughs> I, mean... I don't have air conditioning, and I was excited to come today because I thought there'd be some air conditioning. Yeah. <laughs> so I get some relief. Yeah, yeah, we, we were like all excited about a lot of different yeah. things tonight. But, oh, okay. uh, yeah, but um, let's. Uh, congratulations Thank you. on Morning Phase. Thank you. It is a genuine masterpiece, and I'm intrigued oh. to know when you've made as many albums as you have. Uh, when you finish an album like Morning Phase, do you think, oh, this is a this is a real winner? This is one that's going to be no great. Idea. Or, really? Yeah, no, no idea. So, uh, but have there been <laughs> have there been have there been albums where you've thought, oh, I'm not sure about this track, and it goes on to be a huge? It's always a surprise. Yeah. yeah. Now, one thing I'm excited mm. uh, about um, that's coming up for you, but you're about to go on tour, mm -hmm. and when you go to London, you're playing with the Strokes. Strokes, yeah. That's so exciting. In uh, Hyde Park. It's going to be yeah. amazing. It's going to be great. I've known them for a long time. I uh, we did a show with them before their first album. I guess like 2000 or 2001. Oh, really? Yeah. Even before like last night and stuff like that? Yeah, before, exactly. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah. yeah. Have they changed so, much as a band? I think they're, they're pretty similar. Yeah, no, they were always very, uh, you know, friendly and open. And my first, uh, I remember we, we were playing with them at a festival in Norway and they were riding down a hill on deck chairs. Like literally, sort of <laughs> swallowing down. That was my introduction. To the then strokes. we had a, a three-hour badminton match. Oh my god. Yeah, after that. <laughs> so that's what happens backstage. <laughs> so rock and roll nice. nowadays, isn't it, Tommy? Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. Tommy's just losing his <laughs> mind. Look at him. He's, you can come closer, Tommy. Come on. Get in. Get in. Come on. Closer. <laughs> now, Tommy, you're sat here with one of your absolute heroes. Yeah, one of my favorite Is there... uh, performers of all, of all time. Of all time. Oh, I thank saw you live thank at you. solo at uh, Royal Albert Hall when you Oh really? You saw when you show. played that played there and I saw you at Coachella a couple times oh. and at the El Rey. El Rey. <laughs>